I kind of like going with leaving the stock tie rod because if you're gonna bend something off-road, I'd rather bend the tie rod and not destroy the rack because these I carry spares of and it's easy to keep. But if you're gonna put badass heavy duty ones from all the companies that we work with like SVC, which are great upgrades, but that ends up not bending and your rack ends up breaking. So it's much easier to replace this on the trail than your rack on the trail. Don't ask me how I know. But when you go off-road, if, uh, if the standard hardware is left in there, this is not the standard, but if the standard hardware is left in there, with the first few bumps, this lower control arm can move in this pocket and throw off your alignment. Because this is a common place that's gonna get beat up by rocks and debris off the road, off the trail. So you wanna beef it up like we did. You see that weld plate we did uh, to make sure this doesn't bend when you get hit by a basketball sized rock or, or whatever else you might see on the road. 